Hey everybody, Jay Barino here. Welcome back. Continuing Nature's Call, Return of the Dragon. Starting Chapter 2, Gathering Allies. Interesting campaign so far. Seems like it's trying some new stuff. Kind of equate this similar to Joe's Quest. It's older, and it was just trying some... Some, quote, cutting-edge stuff. Quote. After consuming the restoration potion of the Tauran tribal shaman, Metamorphosis' first task in Kalimdor is to establish a new base and search for allies. Okay, here we go. Straight into it. Find a good location okay. for your first base. Can we use our yes. dragon form now? Okay. Let's get some spiders. Yes. Might as well get started straight away. Oh, for a second I thought they netted me, but now they... Or, or I want like my infer inferno spiders somehow, or chaos spiders somehow netted them, but no, it was just a murloc net. In dragon form, you can reach more areas than in spider form. You don't say. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's just clear out the the typical area just to get started here. Then we'll figure out what we're really doing here. Waiting for more little spiders. This map seems fairly large. The last one was also pretty large. So these guys are ranged, so the web is not going to help me very much, is it? This might be a good spot for a burrow. Let's just move on up here and sit under the mana fountain. Give me a burrow. Alright, these guys aren't doing that much damage. Again, there is a mana fountain, but they don't have mana. So once we come back up, we can drop some more spiders on them. Granted, we probably won't have the mana to do it. But I could also just keep burrowing. And slowly kill them. Or I could turn into a... A flying dragon. Kind of curious to see if my abilities will change. Got some more flowers here. See, these are inconspicuous, unless you mouse over them. What is happening here? There's just a zeppelin flying around. Alright, we could probably kill these guys now. Well, maybe not. Why are they missing sometimes? Is there like a weird hill here? Or am I missing sometimes? I don't know. Let's do this one more time. Yeah, that's what happened in the first mission. Like, I, the flowers were there, and I knew I was looking for flowers, but um, if you don't have them moused over, they sort of just look like normal doodads, but luckily I did find them. Come on, just attack the one who's right there, dude. Okay, finish him up. Pretty happy with the items that we have here, just to get started at least. Gloves of haste. feel like you can't go wrong with those. Yeah, he's technically uphill, I guess. It's really irritating. There we go. Flower. Yum. I really wish those were for more HP. Let's go dragon form. What is going on with the Zeppelin? Consumes an enemy land unit, slowly digesting it and dealing 10 damage per second to it. If the dragon is killed while the consume unit is still digesting... Okay, right. So that's just normal devour. We can switch back. Okay, so it's not timed. We can just stay in this form. Exchange the position of the caster and the targeted unit. I... It takes 10 seconds to do. I don't really like that at all. Increases armor by five. That's kind of lame. Takes over control of a unit. That's cool. Whirlwing. Makes the ground tremble and break, causing zero damage per second to buildings and slowing units by 90%. Well, I assume <laughs> zero damage per second doesn't seem great. I don't understand. Okay, well, let's just fly around and okay. see what we can find. Yes. Of course. Flowers. Okay. Death. Can I get a higher level? See, it looks like I can just go ahead and kill these guys, no problem. They can't even attack air, they can't net me. I don't know, it's almost more annoying that they run away. I like how they go back to sleep after they try to flee. Poor guys. How are we gaining XP? It doesn't seem like the bar is really going up. Okay, no, we just got XP there. Oh, you know what, does he have separate XP bars in the different forms? Because that is definitely possible. Which is a reason why we're going to want to switch between the different forms back and forth. Because we want to get more of those understand. chaos spiders as well. Okay. Level 6? I don't really know what I'm looking for here. Alright, some of these can attack air. Many of them can attack air, actually. Use defensive carapace. Okay, let's play it cool. We're taking some heat. We got some flowers here. It's no problem. Those flowers ain't gonna save us. <laughs> so this is level six. 
Mm, I think what we want to do is come over here, shape shift, and then give him some chaos spiders. Might be able to get up to level three here. Good stun, good stun. Get the flowers. And then we'll take this guy out. I didn't see if us killing stuff in the shapeshifted form really makes a difference or not. Obviously, more chaos spiders, please. We're low on mana. I can always backtrack to the fountain. This map seems large. Oh, we'll stop him, all right. Stop the goblin yes. from terrorizing the countryside. Magic acorn can summon an end to I aid you. Understand. Okay, okay. Okay. Huh. Well, let's yes. pick those up. I assume we get little tree ends. Of course. Interesting find. Okay. Uh, let's go back to dragon form. Let's get up to level three with dragon. Yes. Just being able to fly in general, obviously, has huge advantages. So we're looking yes. for that flyer. I think we'd have to be in spider form and we can web him. That's my plan, at least. Again, let's get whatever... Uh, the murlocs can't swim. Anyway, um, again, this is a pretty large map. We've uncovered maybe like one-tenth of it. So we got a ways to go. Let's kill all the creeps that we can, just to maximize XP, though I suspect by the end of this we won't have an issue. We've seen the guy flying around. I think we're just going to have to net him, because I really can't think of any other way to deal with him. We're also getting some gold. Maybe we'll be able to use that at some point. Maybe we can also locate his general flight path and deal with him later. Deciding the best time to use these Ents as well. And let's just fly around and get some vision around this whole area. <coughs> oh, it looks like I can't go... Oh, okay, there's heavy winds blocking me. Okay, well, that's kind of clever. Just to gate the player from flying certain places, I suppose. Okay, well, I do enjoy uncovering as much as possible, so let's maybe stick to the top here. He said rocks block the way to the, the potential gold mine location, but, like, we can fly. I understand there's no lumber, though. There's a tree, though. He lied to us. All right, so okay. this is another instance where I think yes. maybe I can okay. devour one of these, kill the little one, and then the bigger one, summon a tree in to help us out. 
Oh, and they just immediately dispelled it. This is another instance where I'm probably going to have to shift back. And then I can use Defensive Carapace again. E is not working. If I hit D, that's the proper hotkey. Weird. I kind of want to kill this level 6, though, in... Oh, there he is. Okay, well, I kind of want to just kill this level 6 in flyer form so that maybe I can get up to level 3 and sort of maximize that. Do I... <laughs> what would I want to level up here? Displacement. I'm gonna, I mean, I think the mental domination is a little too good to pass up. You can just fly around and pick up some flowers after this. Again, this is a little min-maxi doing it this way. It would be so much easier with the chaos. I could summon the chaos spiders and then shift into my flyer form. Okay, that almost got me where I wanted to be. Alright, let's go find that little shit. So he's not invulnerable anymore, so that's a plus. This should get us to level 3 if we kill these guys. So we got the real slow... You know, chase them, force them into a corner, and then attack them until they die. We want to get into a position where the, the direction they flee is going to be against water so that they can't move out past that. Level 3, baby. Let's go. There it is. Okay, let's grab Mental Domination. Okay. suppose I can just devour these. Okay, let's go chase this piece of shit. Get him. Chase him down. He's neutral. Okay. Hello? So he stops to attack the trees. It might be better to web him. But we'd have to wait for him to fly directly over us for that to work. I could just A-click him. He'll stop every so often to hit a tree, and we get a few free hits in. For some reason, he stopped. I wonder if I can mentally dominate him. No, must target organic units. I could also use displacement and, sh and put him behind me. But it takes 10 whole seconds. I see, so the exchange happens faster at a level up. I just don't see the benefit in that, honestly. Very specific situations. You stupid! Why you attack me, moron? I was testing my new bombs, and you interrupted my research. An ancient asked me to stop you in exchange for lumber and a free passage through the Eastern Canyon. Eastern Canyon? What's your mission, strange creature? I am here to find new allies to launch an assault on Northrend. Assault? Touch my brothers who live there and I'll kill you! Brothers? Don't say Kaboing and Kaboom are your brothers. I met them some time ago. They helped me and my queen. Yes, yes, those my brothers are. May I join your team? I want to protect my brothers from any harm. You are a maniac. And maniacs often prove valuable. So feel free to follow me. <laughs> okay, now we've got... Kazam! Dimensional bag which allows you to store up to five items. Kazam helped his former mentor, the Tauran tribal shaman Tarak, with a very complicated protection potion. The potion was a full success, and as a reward, he got his magic bag to store more ingredients for others. Oh, dear. Okay, well, I guess we'll figure that out later. So he gets landmines. Jetpack. So he can fly as well. Huh. Okay, so we got a level one battle goblin. So we got to find some stuff for, to, for this guy to kill as well. Seems like it's gonna be harder to level up metamorphous and dragon form. So maybe we should start with that. You're going down. Okay, we should have no problem killing these. And again, maybe we want to get up to level four with metamorphous early. We should go back and talk to the tree, I suppose. He should open stuff up for us, or we could just continue killing stuff to get leveled up. I like how he shoots little grenades. So he's not too uh, far away. Ah, yeah. get, get some levels, buddy. Just make sure you stay close. Hey, okay. We might have to use the jetpack to get him over. Oh, no, he is capped at level 3 when he's flying. So to me, that probably means we want to... I don't understand. Probably just want to... 
turn him into his ground form. Okay, so that looks like everything here. So let's fly back. This uh, this tree lord makes me just imagine that the creator probably had watched Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers, around the time that this had come out. All right, let's jetpack. This is interesting. Uh, I guess I guess let's bring him with us. What happens if we try to land over water? You think he instantly dies? Okay, well, this is a lot more contained than I expected. I thought this would end up with a lot more stuff that we'd have to do, but that's not, not bad at all. Could pick up our other acorn as well. Well done. Follow me. I can clean the path for you as I promised. Smash. I see harpies back here. The path is free now. Take this lumber and the tree seed. You might need it. Since lumber is rare in the desert. Tree seed? Hello? Alright, come back, buddy. I'm getting ready. Cause he has an inventory, right? I don't so understand. the purple It's indicative uh -huh. that he still has an inventory, right? No no no, don't do that. We'll figure out what that hey, okay. backpack's all about later. Sure. Okay, hey, land. Okay. Sure. So we have this tree seeds 30 trees. Metamorphos helped Dust Tree to protect the trees from Kazam. As a gift, he received these trees, these tree seeds to establish a base. 350 lumber is not much. Hey, okay. Maybe he'll give us more. I don't know. I don't understand. Oh, and I guess we have to land. Again, this is an interesting way to make sure the player can only proceed a specific way through certain parts. Um, so yeah, I guess he's probably capped at level 3 in this form as well. So we're looking for a gold mine. See, there's some trees over there. Sure. I'm getting ready. I like the idea of being able to just make trees sure. wherever we want. That's kind of cool. I'm getting ready. Doesn't it look like we should be able to cross hey, over okay. there? We'll worry about I'm that later. Ready. Let's just look for the gold mine sure. and maybe get a base set up so that we can actually build hey, okay. units to support us and sure. get through this map maybe a little quicker. Hey, okay. okay, harpies. I don't understand. I, we can attack air <coughs> no problem, so... Let's just take these out the old-fashioned way. Did we get next? Let's keep an eye out on our XP here. 570. No. Okay, we're capped. Well, we got level 3 real quick. Gotta get both forms. I like the idea of having two forms that you have to level sure. up separately. Hey, okay. It's gotta be right, <coughs> right sure. around here. You're going I also want to make sure we get Kazam leveled up as soon as possible. Uh, let's get some Chaos Spiders here. Boom, boom, boom. Now we have three. Very strong. I mean, they've been nerfed, but they're still really good. The issue is that they are... They're summoned, so they die really fast to, to uh, these Thunder Lizards, which have a, a purge that they can use. Okay, cool. You're level two. Learn Super Suicide. <clears throat> and then he comes back. Okay. Running Bomb. Maybe suicide goblins who run at any enemy they spot. Creates a potion. That's... That's cool. I'm going to get running bomb, just because then we can use those to maybe break trees if we so desire, even though apparently there won't be that many trees here. This little guy <laughs> ended up up top. Can use you to look around, I guess. This cough, I swear. It's worse at night. That's how I know it's allergy-related. It's just... Ugh. I'm ready. Uh, let's keep Why going, I, I guess. Away. Kill these, uh... Oh, can I help you? Kill these jerks. Let's go ahead and get our little little guys out. Can I control them? Yes. Ooh, that's, yeah, that's a lot of damage. I'm glad I went for that first. Can he get up to level three? Yes, he can. So good, yeah. Let's, uh, let's focus on getting these heroes both set up. I like how there's now a second hero that we can control. Hello? Sure. Hello? I'm getting ready. 
sure. I think this area hey, okay. is gonna end up just being superfluous. Sure. Let's check over here. This area we weren't we weren't able to cross over earlier. Hey, okay. I think pointless. Yep. Well, I guess hey, the extra okay. gold, which we're going to need later, is we're setting up a base, so I can't complain there. Hard to say at this point if this is going to be a video sure. that ends up getting split or not. I hope not, hey, but we'll okay. see. Again, there's a lot of the map left, but I'll it also seems ready. to be pretty confined in the sense, like, hey, okay. individual things are happening at in specific points of the map, and then you move on. So, might not be as large as it seems. Okay, sure. Uh -huh. More sure. just normal thunder lizards, plus tons and tons of flowers hey, okay. if we ever need to fall back. Sure. <clears throat> Alright, so hey, let's okay. uh, suicide. I, I could also use mines here. It doesn't look like those are replenishable, but I might, I might as well use them. This should get Kazam close to level 3, and we can maybe just level up running bomb again. The, the ability to fly is good. See what, what level three is. Oh wow, restoration potion is so good. Okay. Uh, can I help you? So let's make oh, our way over to the gold mine to at least trigger starting to build, uh -huh. and then we can continue looking around. This is a good spot for a base. Use your spider egg to breed a worker spider. Huh. Okay. I don't understand. Interesting. Well, here we go. Build a spider base. Okay, cool. Well, we can continue to look around then while we wait for this to build. I'm sure these two heroes alone can clear a lot of this as long as we're gen careful, just generally careful. And it looks like there's only one way to proceed, so I guess let's do that. I could also fly and look around up on these cliffs. There's probably secrets and such up there, so we'll check all that later. Maybe at the, <coughs> at the end of the map I'll just use the vision sheet or just fly around as much as possible. Mm, there is no point to this existing, I think. I'll Just ra I, guess I could have come up here to reach the base hey, initially, okay. but this would have been closed, I imagine. Uh -huh. Whatever. Anyway, I'll to get this base established, it's going to take a really long time. Uh, what I'm going to do you. is come over here and yeah. seed the trees. Hey, okay. I'm getting ready. Let's see how that... Actually, ju uh -huh. just use one and see how it works. Hey, okay. Sure. Um. Hello? I'm getting ready. Are they gonna grow, you think? Oh no, they grow later. Uh -huh. Okay, cool. Hey, okay. This is very sure. interesting. Hey, okay. Sure. Very novel way to allow the player to grow trees that they can then harvest. Okay, I let's continue. Understand. I see more dragons up there. Our town hall finished. Welcome, half-breed. I sense your draconic heritage. I ask you for assistance. Undead forces are attacking us. They convert our dead bones into frost worms. If you don't help us, we are doomed. I see you're in trouble. I am in need of an ally in my fight against the undeads. Follow me to Northrend, and I'll get rid of those undeads. I must decline. My whelps need me here in Kalimdor. The desert is our home. We only wish to survive, but there are five possible heroes which might aid you in your quest. I'm talking about the breed of the five great aspects. I know where they are located. As soon as you've saved our existence, 
I'll provide you with all the information you need to continue your quest. So be it. <laughs> Is Return of the Dragons meant to be Return of all of the dragon aspects, maybe? That's interesting. All right, let's get a lumber mill we can't build it. over there. And then he'll start doing his thing. So we can get web, spider, strength, huta. Increases the damage of all spiders, sure. Carapace and then cannibalize we know is quite good. And I like how the, the spiders actually hatch from these egg sacs as you build them. So we got a lot to do. What? Let's keep exploring okay. a little bit. So we want to get up there and help. Of Fountain of healing in the random water there, okay. sure. Of I would like to just get up here to these dragons to get started, and there's plenty to explore on the right as well, which I might use him to just fly around and do that while we build the base. Hello, dragons. So we have two undiscovered quests, establish a base, which we're on the way to do, and then protect the dragons. So those are all the main quests. If we do all of those, then this will end, in theory. Okay, build more spider ziggurats. Let's do that. Nothing at the lumber mill to buy. Mm, let's get one more spider ziggurat up there just so we can continue building quickly. I think that those are going to attack me and not the dragons. How dare you? Can I help you? All right, little buddy. This is all you. I wonder if he gets... Oh, well, that's not good. ready. <laughs> sure. We'll put these out like this. Well, if that detonates, it might hurt my building significantly, so I might just destroy it. Can I help you? Let's very slowly do that, and we're going to actually do AoE damage to my base, but that's fine. Okay, let's get some more workers. There we go. We're safe. Uh, come over and repair this and then get on lumber. Ghouls die. Grab running bomb. And then don't we have defensive spiders? We don't, but we do have fissures, which breeds toxic broodlings, spider barracks. Okay, we'll be fine. Just go ahead and set up a spider barracks over there. You set up a fissure down here and then get on lumber. Meanwhile, let's keep exploring. Okay. Let's just use shapeshift to do this. And see what's up here. Just okay. explore all of this, please. Of Very slowly. Just check everything that's on this cliff area. Haven't found any secrets yet. <coughs> Excuse me. And we just got to wait for more of these buildings to finish. We're going to need more lumber in the long run. Let's grab basic upgrades and more web. Need more lumber. That's okay. We're going to have some spiders coming out to help us. Cancel these both and get a few extra spiders for lumber, then queue these up. I see just trees back here. Again, i sort of expecting to have something pop up on the minimap once they show up. Kind of concerned that the ghouls decided to attack me, which really just means I need to get some more... I need to get some more units out, like, as soon as possible. So this spider barracks needs to finish. Okay, let's keep an eye out here to see if there's any units in this location. There might also be something down here. One toxic pool in barracks that's on its way. Gives them the ability to hide. I don't really care about that, so. Do you have anything that's <coughs> only gold? No, everything costs resources in some way. Cool, so we can make Crypt Fiend, Crypt Crawler. Okay, so interesting. So this is different than the than what existed in the pre- Ooh! Claws of Attack plus six. This is different than what existed in the previous, uh... Previous mission. Can I use Mental Domination? And then just have this thing fly directly into the undead base? Pick up these. Here, let's come down and give him the acorns, then we can go pick this up. How long is this gonna last for? Kill these for us. Or get yourself killed, it's fine. Let's see what this lady drops. Nothing. That's fine. Uh, can I help you? 
Okay, so here, take some acorns so that we can use these to help us out. I think these are a little superfluous to have in general, but that's fine. All right, so let's grab Toxic Broodlings for our frontliner support, and then Crypt Fiends, and then Crypt Crawlers. Let's go pick up some Claws. We have Claws plus three, but who cares? And then, like I had mentioned, we got a bunch to explore, so we're going to start moving out here pretty soon once we get a few more units. A bunch of flowers over here, too. So let's check all of this down here, and then here, and then here. Again, because we don't know what we've really missed. There is a cave here which may allow us to go underground. Let's try this. No, okay. That's fine. So let's have let's check down in this location and then we'll come back and settle up and up there. Toxic spiders. Okay, they're under attack. We want to go for the undead here pretty soon. Let's go web. We do have crypt fiends coming out. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> Are they supposed to look like this? Weird. Okay, they seem like they're going to be able to hang on for a while. What is going on down here, though? I don't understand. Metamorphous, take this. By the way, are you... Okay, you're intelligence-based. I don't understand. I found a sub... Is this a sub-map? Yes. Oh, no. Sub-map for map two. Water Island. Going to pick up some shells? No. I don't understand. Um... If we eat and then we shift back, does it? I think I think it just immediately despawns whatever is inside of you. Oh no, there no, it did respawn. Okay. I was wondering how that was gonna work. Oh my god, there's so many ways to exit. I'm so confused, and it's hard to know what is a bug and what isn't on this map. Because this map functions, it doesn't crash, but there were just basic bugs that are still in it. This is a very small sub-map, so this shouldn't take very long. And then after this, as long as we have... I mean, if all we have to do is essentially destroy the undead base, I'm not too concerned. Uh, I'm a little concerned about the fact that there's like a billion exits through this area. I don't like that one bit. Oh, these poor hermit crabs. They don't deserve to die like this. Okay, get them, little guys. Web here, it's not it's not ranged, so it doesn't even matter. Or it is ranged. I'm not sure what it's doing though. It's just kind of sitting there. I don't I don't I don't understand. Just like Metamorphosis is saying. Ha ha! What is the purpose of this? I hope we can take the gold that we're gonna get from this area and bring it out. We'll be able. To, we'll see. Giant sea turtle. Maybe we'll get an item or something. And then random little guys that'll give me more little spiders. Healing salve. I'll just use that on myself. This is weird, right? I'm not crazy. This is just a weird little sub map, but... Okay, we got a Hydra here. Level 6? I think we can handle this. We've, we've killed level 6s before. Kill the hatchlings first. And then we can just call down more Chaos Spiders, and then we can get out of here. I assume we're just going to get an item for this, but I don't know. Boom. Boom. Good stuns. Good stuns. Yep, kill the little ones first. And that should do it. And then we can just fly to get out, I, I presume. I'm going to fly around the bottom, too, because I want to see if there's anything down there. There's a bunch of little creeps. They're just, you know, they're ho they're marked as hostiles, I think, specifically so that we can... Uh, I think they're marked as hostiles specifically so we can kill them easier in order to get more little guys. All right, so let's fly. <clears throat> so it's just a giant circle around it. I gotta check the bottom here. It's probably roped in as well. So what happens if I try to leave? Hang on, let me quick save. What happens if we try to leave right here? Okay, it just immediately exits us. Okay, that's fine.
That is absolutely fine. So, I'm glad that I came down here. Let's check this. We know there's one more secret. I wonder what's up there. The bronze dragons actually go and attack. Good for them. Okay, you all turn on web. Let's grab level two. We continue to... It looks like we continue to harvest while this was happening, which is good. Good news. Anything here? Nope. Okay, let's go check up in this <coughs> this area. Looks like we're gonna have to come up here. Okay, they rebuilt the little dragons that is like their outermost defense. So we should be fine. Especially if we just go ahead and change our hot our, our units here to come up and just kind of sit under these bronze dragons. And let's take these units and go and do the same thing. We should be able to intercept any enemies that are on their way to maybe get, <coughs> get to my base instead. Dryads? We know these are also immune to magic. Yeah. Um, I don't have enough mana, even if I wanted to do something here to help with this specific situation. Looks like there's going to be something behind those trees as well. Again, I can't get down there, though, so... It seems like... Oh, there's so many, There's two undiscovered side quests. What the heck are those, and where do we pick them up from? <laughs> There's a fountain of health, like, right here, so I'm not too concerned. We'll just back up and I'll, it'll all be fine. The ghouls will come and attack us from this location, and we've got Kazam. Okay, he does... He can he can get mines back. Okay, hopefully those hit something. How you doing over here, Metamorphos? He's doing okay. I don't understand the purpose of these existing at all, but it's fine. I really like how he gets those mines back. Goblin landmines are extremely strong. He says after not using them properly at all when he had a hero with infinite mines when playing Legends of Arcane Second Orc Book. All right, let's go get healed up. I'm at 37 minutes. Like, do I think I can finish this now? And if I can't, then I'm going to just have to sit. I mean, the, the I feel like the second video is just going to be so quick. What the heck are the bonus objectives, though? Get those toxic broodlings out. I don't understand. Okay, let's come on down here along the bottom. Okay. I also know that, yeah, there are centaurs up there. Okay. I think I'm meant to explore this with Metamorphos, because I don't think I can get over here easily with anything else. Apparently, the, uh, the enemies just simply aren't going to attack us anymore. I'll take that. That's fine. They've just decided, nah, we, you know... It's fine. Why don't we shapeshift, can web, and then we can call down spiders. They can attack the things that we web, I think, right? And it lasts a while, too. That's great. Okay, Wind Witch, you're dead. <clears throat> and then we can just barely web that. It's going to pull us all the way back. We need more farms. We're almost through all the trees that we had here. This is just, it's very odd, isn't it? Okay, let's bring these chaos spiders up here to attack the, uh, the centaur that we know are here. And I got a good amount of units, feeling pretty comfortable with that. Wake them up. Mm, I hate this. Okay, back away. Let, let my... Let my infernal spiders or chaos spiders deal with it. I hate the centaur sorcerers. I hate them. They are just the worst. They cast bloodlust. They have a really strong piercing attack. Just the worst. Okay, he's gone. Still looking for some sort of side quest that must exist somewhere. Salve yourself, buddy. I could jetpack over here, too, keep in mind. Huh. Again, at this at this point, I'm just sort of aimless. I have no idea what I'm looking for or where I'm going. Let's go back into dragon form. 
and then fly up here. We just got vision of something down there. A goblin observatory. Hang on. Go back to that. That might There might be someone there who's got something for us. And then obviously my goal is to just be able to smash through this silly uh, undead base as soon as possible once this is all done, so... Wow, okay, those are some strong upgrades. Um... <laughs> weird. I can send out a goblin jet to bomb my enemies, but why? <laughs> I don't have enough gold for that, but that's okay. We're in low upkeep, got plenty of money. Now I found a way gate and some tauren. Okay, hello? A razor man steal food from us. If you get rid of them, we'll aid you in your battle against the undead. Destroy the nearby razor man encampment. Okay, I wonder if we can do this alone. Have I already killed the razor mains? Where are they? Okay. Okay, well now there are no trees, so these guys... Oh, this has got to be it. Okay. Yes. I am your worst well, I don't have enough... Well, I could transform and drop more spiders. I don't have enough mana to do that, so I think we just have to wait. These toxic spiders are real weird. <laughs> They're just so weird. They have heavy armor, too. Bizarre. <clears throat> Alright, well, we're keeping these guys alive, obviously. That's not a problem. Okay, and then these workers, let's go... Can we get them, like, in here somehow? Or where are their trees? There really aren't any, are there? How's your mana doing, buddy? I need to be able to shape-shift him and then call down my... my chaos spider, so let's just wait. <clears throat> then we can go and talk to... these other clowns. This guy's doing a good job here. Why don't you put down some more mines? Boom. I really should turn the, the vanilla music off. It's really distracting. There, there, and there. All right, you got chaos spiders for me? Yes, you do. Just like that, buddy. Ah, those tarins took all the land. We have not enough food. Remove the tarins. <laughs> ah, okay. Destroy the nearby Torrin camp to get razor mains. Uh, obviously we're gonna go with the Torrens because we're not we're not awful. Well, here's something. <laughs> Kill the medicine man, because if they ever wisen up. This doesn't seem right. Let's quick save here. I don't understand. Here, destroy their buildings first. I'm kind of concerned because we picked this one up second. What's going to end up happening is the game is going to assume that we're siding with the with the razor mains. I have no idea though. This is a very odd map if that's not clear. Right? It's it's weird. I don't understand. This is gonna take some time also, and my chaos spider's gonna run out. I don't <clears throat> do we do a different di no, it's, it's still gonna be hero damage when we I don't know, man. Now this one. Best they can do is let's let's fly back to the torrent and see if they ha if they'll say anything different to us. Let's hopefully destroy this before I don't understand. anything changes. See, they're still neutral to us. Of course. No, no peace brokerage. I see. I Proceed. Like, of course we're gonna side with the flippin' Torrin. Are you crazy? What? I don't understand. Well, at least he does a little bit more damage. So you gotta attack here. Here, here, and here. And then separately, I suppose I could take these units now and start looking around for, like, the undead base or something. I could also scout with what's-his-name. 
some of the gold mine up here. That's just silly. Okay, well, I'm glad we at least found the extra optional objectives. That's something. This is gonna take a really long time. Okay, we found the we found the undead base. Turn on running bomb. Kablam. You know what I can do? Well, bu buildings won't activate these, right? It's just enemies. We can lay these down next to the ziggurats, and then the, the enemies coming in should activate them. Seems just like Crypt Fiends are going to do the job for us. Yes, perfect. Yeah, run over the mines. And then, over the course of eight to nine hundred years, we'll slowly kill this thing. So, there's just a million ziggurats. That's fun. Let's focus fire. <clears throat> and focus fire, please. I really like these little suicide guys, though, because they can kill the spirit towers pretty fast. Not immediately, but pretty fast. <laughs> Feral spirits. Okay. Uh, well, <clears throat> slowly but surely... We're not going to need those torrents help by the time this is over. Also, aren't they landlocked? We have no way to get them. O oh, there's a way gate. I was going to say, we have no way to get them. All right, keep it up. This poor guy is just getting destroyed. Run into this one. And run into this one. Oh, they automatically attack the crypt fiends that are there, too. You can do it, buddies. Gotta be careful with this guy. We have an altar, though, so it's not too concerning. Yes, do it! Get the treants! Get in there, buddies! They're timed, right? Yeah, they are. Just stay back. It'll be fine. Oh, my God. <laughs> what a mission. <clears throat> Two more shots. The Torrin are your allies now. Great. Hop on through here. What do we? Who do we have here? Just Torin Chieftain. Cool. All right. Goom 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 goom. Walk on through there, buddies. And let's meet on up up here. There's nothing we can do about the razor mains. I wonder if we killed the Torin now, it would technically complete that. Why do I have a? Oh, okay, cool. It's just a normal Kodo beast with slam. That's pretty interesting. These are marked as friendly. I wonder if we could build out of those. Probably not. Who needs Torrin allies? Not this guy. We don't have Burrow, do we? <gasps> Mount Drake? So that the spider can attack from the air. Spiders riding dragons. This is a real dream. Spiders riding dragons. We have reached Pinnacle Warcraft 3. <laughs> That's too funny. That is just too funny. Okay, onwards. Pretty sure we're. I'm pretty sure we're done now. Build one toxic pool. Can I build a toxic pool? Yes, I just never did it. Get that set up. Good thing we have enough lumber for that. So let's get in here and destroy most of the base. My concern, as you can probably imagine, is that we were probably supposed to finish the base building before we attack this enemy base, but I think we'll be able to finish this. No problem here. Come on over here. Um, let's do this and grab Chaos Spiders, because those are just too good. This is a big base. Chaos Spiders, get rid of these. Okay, there we go. So quest complete there. We're pro actively protecting the... Uh, actively protecting the, the dragons and destroying the undead. And we got the Tauren as well that are currently blocked. All right, let him in. Okay, you're fine. Give me another uh, running bomb. Why does it seem like enemies are constantly only targeting him? Is that just me? That's what it looks like. Okay, no heroes in this base means the altar means nothing. They had two gold mines. Okay, where is Metamorphosis? 
We're gonna shift you back into a dragon. It, his hotkey gets reset every time you transform him. That's fine. Okay, I wanna fly. Why is this revealed? I have to see what this is. Because we know there's a third secret somewhere on this map, but I don't know where, so let's look. Or have I found all three secrets? Well, in any case, let's fly around. We'll destroy most of these buildings. Again, this is certainly unique, but it's not particularly challenging or anything like that. It's just just kind of wacky. But I like it. I like wacky stuff. Okay, let's fly over there, 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 and there. And we're just kind of steadily waiting for this to end. Kablam! Finish it up. Perfect. So destroy the gold mine here. Destroy the gold mine here. We can leave the Temple of the Damned because I know that that is going to count towards actually finishing the mission. It, whatever it might, it might be as simple as being like right there. I don't know. We're not going to know until we fully explore all these silly areas. There's a lot of empty space all over this map. Uh, I know <coughs> one of the secrets was here. One of the secrets is like in this general vicinity with the harpy. No idea what could be left. Let's just check this last area, then I'll probably just use the vision cheat and then we're done. What a, again, it's it's an odd map. Oh wait, I see something. Oh, just regular harpies. Whatever. Just ignore those. Let's check this area, because it's the last place before I just give in and use the vision sheet. Though I don't know what I'm really looking for. Oh, it could be something up there, too. I don't okay, let's just, let's just do it so that I don't waste too much time just looking around. I don't understand. There's nothing up there. Huh. I don't know. Could it be killing this level 7 Harpy Queen? He's got nothing for us. We already went in here. It could have been something in there. I don't think so, though. Or did I get all three and not realize it? Can we out-damage the healing fountain? Can I maybe lure this thing over here? That's cool looking. Can we land? Web. And then kill this thing with the spiders. Yeah, there we go. That's how you do it. That's how you flip and do it. And then we just we'll web it again. Don't rejuve, you son of a bitch. I never picked up those extra claws. Gotta go back and get those. I swear I picked those up. Am I crazy? I don't understand. <clears throat> oh my goodness. What has become of me? I guess... It's just this pit? I don't... Well, okay. We ticked it off. We, we got the checkbox. That's all that matters, right? We did it one way or the other. There's really nothing in here. I don't understand. Let's go pick up our claws. You all attack this. What? There we go. I got my claws. You know what it was? Because I went back to give something to my to my goblin hero. There we go. You protected the dragons from the undead. A very slow camera pan. Hello? Ma'am, please turn to face me. I'd appreciate it. You saved our lives. And as promised, I'll tell you where you can find the five dragon robes of the five great aspects. Not far from here to the south, you'll find a small cave entrance. The entrance is too small for a dragon to enter, but in spite of all, it should be no problem. Farewell, my friend. May Nosdorn watch over your time.
Is it really gonna make me fly down there? Oh my god. I don't understand. It was it was here, wasn't it? There it is. Or maybe it was supposed to end. I don't know. Let's just go down there and we'll turn into our little other form. And then I'm just going to end the video. <clears throat> I don't even know what the cheat is. I don't even know what the cheat is to end the mission with a victory trigger. Oh, can I help you? Not sure if this guy's going to need to be down there too. I hope not. He was a nice little addition to this, but what, the po what was the point of the dimensional bag? I'm so confused. More ingredients for other items that we didn't need to use. <clears throat> Again, this is another map where it's like, I view it more experimental than anything, considering how old it is. So again, you've always got to contextualize that, though. I imagine, you know, some parts of this might not have been the most thrilling to watch, but it's always interesting to play just to kind of experiment and see where I things are. Understand. Of course. Yes. Okay, please end. Of course. Yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> Do I need this guy too? I swear. What's the fastest way to get down there? From my spider base. I, I'll, I'll, I'll spare you. Okay, the cheat is all your base are belong to us, but let's see if we just need to get this guy inside there. And if not, again, we'll fire the victory trigger ourselves. Okay, great. That's all we needed to do. Just didn't tell us. All right, we'll head into map three next time. Uh, this is a wacky one. <laughs> See you then. Bye now.